Daddy's back, you bitches! Hello, uh, Daddy's Talk back, you me, bitches! Dave, oh, come on. Oh, go. What are you doing? Dave is not coming. Ah, ignore him. Come on, we got to get this thing ready before we dock. Let's go. Here, pass me that. You ever been? No. Crazy place, Nico. <laughs> what you going to do? I might come back on board, or I might try to make a go of it. Like they say, it is the land of opportunity. I always wanted to make it big, on a nice place, get a dog, a house. Live the dream! Like my cousin. Oh, yeah? Yes, he's got the love. House, women, cars, parties. Uh, he writes me in these wild emails, and after I got into trouble, I thought maybe, uh... Then I got this gig, and I spent the next seven months with you fine people, and I forget. <laughs> After the war finished, I couldn't get a job. Nobody could. Uh, so I uh, did some dumb things, got involved with some idiots. Ah, we all do dumb things. That's what makes us human. Could be. Stay in Hove Beach. 
Everyone like a stars. This is the mansion? <laughs> Just a temporary place. The mansion is coming, cousin. That's the dream. Follow me. <laughs> come in, come in! Make yourself at home. What's mine is yours. Uh, got him! <laughs> Little bastard, if he paid some rent, I wouldn't care. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, that's not nice. Ah, <laughs> cousin. It's so good to see you. <laughs> <sighs> Shit! Oh, I need to change anyway. <sighs> so! So. So. So, you full of crap or what? What? Uh, where's luxury condo? Where's sports car? Where's Barbara with big titties and Stephanie who sucks like a vacuum? What are you talking about? In your letters to my mother. In your letters to me. All I hear about is Mr. Big, Mr. Roman, living the American dream. Sports cars, condos, women, money, the beach. Opportunity. I come here and the only thing big about your life is the cockroaches. <laughs> That's right. I got the best cockroaches, I got the best pets. <laughs> Screw you, you idiot. <laughs> okay, I'm an idiot, but you must admit, I have the best line in bullshit you ever heard. Yeah, this I know, asshole. But here. <sighs> All I needed was one good guy. One good guy I could do well. Not take over the world, but do okay. Now maybe I have this. But what about you? What about you, cousin? What? What about me? Well... Why you live home after all this time? First I hear you uh, running with the wrong kind, then I hear you join the Merchant Navy, now you're here! You never tell me anything! <laughs> no. What do you mean, no? No, I never tell you anything. Another time. Ooh, mystery man, strange and exotic sailor. What happened? Did your captain make you pregnant? <laughs> Screw you! <laughs> no, no, it's nothing like that. The ships were fine. It was before that. Two things. You remember, during the war, we did some bad things. And bad things happened to us. <laughs> war is where the young and stupid are tricked by the old and bitter into killing each other. I was very young and very angry. Maybe that is no excuse. Roman? Roman! Ah! Are you sleeping, you fat no, fuck? No Come on! What's the time? Shit, I've got to get the cab back. It's on the shift. <laughs> Stop! Oh, Jesus! Tastes like a rat shot in it! Nico, Jeez. I've got to run. Uh, come meet me at the cab office. It's easy. Out about? the door, turn left, and the first I left of the diner, go down I'm one block and turn right on Iroquois. Then walk all the way down, and we're right there on the left on the corner of Sears. I'm not afraid of him. Yeah, but I can't see. The heart can't leave, Patina. May I come with you? Where's the place? A warehouse on Mohanet. I know the one. You see around the back.
Shot by his, huh? You don't know, my avid scene star. Hey, Nico! Glad you could make it. Yes. You got the money? Sure. But I just wanted to say how grateful me and my bosses are for what you did. Good. Yes. And I just wanted to check something with you. Okay. You are Nico Bellic, correct? What is this? And you used to work the coast in the Mediterranean, smuggling people into Italy. I don't know what you're talking about. But you messed up. And left a lot of bad debt. You left a good friend of mine out of pocket. Big time. Hello, Nico. Hello, Mr. Bulgarin. Ross, where is our money? I don't know. I didn't rob you. Really? We were busted a mile off the coast. I had to swim for my life. I don't know what happened. I nearly drowned. Huh. My heart was bleeding. I did my best. I didn't fuck up. Oh, there you are. Ah! Ah! The rum in this place full, brother. Bumbo cut. They keep coming, Nico. Who are the rats cut? Here, I need backup. Situation here. Get down, everyone. Down here. 
Yo, make a go back to the cafe, you see? We're not to lose Babylon Kia, sight? Sight! Get out of the fucking car now! Everything crashed back there. All and all over the place. Lose them! I'm trying to fucking lose them. No, who fucked up the game back there? What went wrong? I don't fucking know. I can't think about it now. I need to shake these fucking pigs. Ballon just a whole man down. You're right to stand in a nico. You lose Babylon, man. Far back at the cafe, you know. Yeah, I need to block up some more. Hey, what's the hold up? I told you the bitch was a snake in the grass. I didn't know that Mr. Bogren was here in Liberty City. If I could have killed them all then and there. Just chill, they come on, one at a time. One, one cock and fill basket, see? We'll find out where the is, then BAM! We take the rest of them out. Just keep your head down until then. Fucking Dimitri. Made me kill Faust and then he sell me down the river. Just go, Nico. The boy is a general, you know what I'm saying? He's gonna make his own downfall. That I had a monkey climb, the more he expose him bat wall, you see it? I will bring Dimitri down you myself. No I promise you this. I'm gonna speak to Batman. You keep on alone, call your woman and get out of this place. Hey, yeah. thanks for your help, Police Jacob. Expenses. One love, my brother. Enough respect, my brother. Money? Hey, man. Business is tough. Now, I ain't a cold person. I mean, I am cold, but motherfucker. What are you talking about? You want a drink? Uh, man, have a seat, man. All right. Now, I got into this dope game because it was the only thing that was open to me. The only thing, man. Hey, I am not judging. No, listen, I paid my dues. Now I learned in a hard school, man, and I changed stuff. You know me. I do this stuff so I got a chance to do some good in this town. So you say. So I say. So I do. When I get the money, man, I will build parks. I will sponsor kids. I will save lives. But I gotta have the money, man. Is all this? All this, it means nothing if you ain't got the heart, Nico. Amen, brother. <laughs> I mean, fuck, man. Fuck. The thing is, you know, Jesus, he did some crazy shit, too. I mean, everyone does. He killed people. He killed that John the Baptist cat. He did what he had to. I don't think you're correct about that. Man, the point is, man, History is a long time, and you only got one chance. And Dwayne, man, Dwayne, it's like he thinks it's 1992, and the best that you could hope for is a gold chain and a page. You know, he looks at me like he wants me dead. I had to care of business. I gave him money, but because I won't bow down to him and treat him like he the almighty, motherfucker wants to pop me. Dwayne is a little troubled. He was in prison a long time. Maybe you guys should talk. No, I tried talking. No, I, I, I tried giving him half of the business. I tried everything a man could reasonably try and still call himself a man. <laughs> so what you gonna do? Kill him? Hey, I didn't say that. And you cold. I was joking. But what else is there? I mean, Cash been talking. Now I hear things. He said you and me was too tight now. He said you disrespected. Called him mad. He's going crazy. I mean, he's gone. Prison does that. Well, you can't kill him. Nope. But you can. 
but I don't want to. Well, neither do I, man. But if he goes insane, we all dead anyway. I mean, Dwayne is a killer. Uh, I don't like this conversation. But do you think that I do? But it's kill or be killed out there. You got a lunatic after you? Man, you dumb. <coughs> now I will give you a lot of money. Because see me? Now I ain't scared of no one. But a motherfucker says he's gonna kill me, the motherfucker's gonna die. <sighs> Man, I'm not sure. I got to think about it. Well, I hope you see some sense. I will be in touch. Things ever made sense? They made sense inside. Three meals a day, time in the yard, lockdown at eight. Things out here is mad crazy. Tell me about it. Wanna down low? I think Playboy wants me dead. Might just let him do put a cap in my dome. End it all. That what you want? Seriously? Nah, fuck that shit. I ain't ready to go out yet. I need you to get him for me. I can't do it myself. He was my boy back in the day. I thought I won't be able to forget. You seem like you got my back, Nico. I'll be out on this one, dog. I'll stick by you till the end. Take him out for me. That's a pretty heavy request, Dwayne. Playboy was your best friend. And he's always been straight with me, more or less. I'll have to think about it. Dwayne already? I thought the old dog would have put up more of a fight. <laughs> I didn't kill Dwayne. Well, what you doing back here then? Step to it, motherfucker. Well, I was thinking that maybe Dwayne is not the problem. Maybe it's you. Motherfucker! You think you can touch this shit? You think I got here by letting little bitches like you fuck with me? I own you! Nobody owns me! Another motherfucker gone and let the money go to his head. Where are you going, playboy? Nico, you're a bad joke, playboy. Ice this punk. I showed you the world, gangster. You don't control this shit. Even 
even if you kill me, you're gonna have this whole town after your ass. I thought you was money. You a low-rate bitch. It was you or Dwayne. I chose Dwayne. Another motherfucker gone and let the money go to his head. Ah, uh, I was someone, you know. I made it. I changed the game. You didn't change the game. The game changed you. Dwayne, I dealt with Playboy. You should know that he asked me to end you first. He was going to pay me a lot of money to do it. Shit, man. He was a good kid back in the day. Always hungry, though. Always wanted more. Maybe I should have seen it then. Kept a closer eye on him. You can't predict what people will become. You're right. I can't give you no money for helping me, son. But I got the deed to Playboy's fancy silk she love. You can have it. Hey, man, I seen where you're living. You should take it. Nah. It'll make me remember the kid too much. Maybe he'll stop by my place sometime, though. Hang out with me. I don't have many friends left, you know. I'll give you a call sometime soon, Dwayne. Later on. into the country for me. This is almost over. I'm going to finish it. Nico, you can't do this alone. I'm coming with you. Come collect me. Fire up my eyes. All right. Wait there for me. Tell us the name you want to bring. It They are bringing him to the cargo bay at Francis International. I do not want to be late after I've waited so long. This is the big moment that you've been waiting for for so long. I hope you will not be disappointed. Disappointment is not a consideration. I have not been the same man since the day that Darko betrayed us, since I saw those things. You lost a lot of friends that day, Nico. We both did. In some way, our friends from the village were lucky. I lost myself that day too. Everything that was good and innocent in me died along with them. If I could live those hours again, I think I would have preferred to be buried in the pit along with everyone else. This is all that is left of me. What am I good at, Robin? What is my trade? I deal in that. Because that is all that is open to me. I will tell you what you are good at, Nico. You are a good cousin and a good friend. You still have integrity. No matter what you say, there is humanity in you. You still have the power to be good. It's important that you believe that. Maybe I will start to believe it when Darko is dead. That might give me some perspective. This killing must stop sometime, Nico. Once this is done, then you must begin to forgive. Think about your future instead of the horrible things that have happened to you. To us! To all of us! In the past! After this is done, then we can talk about forgiveness and redemption. This is it. This is where it all ends. survived. Nico. Hello. 
Reci mi zašto. Zašto? Zato što smo bili prijatelji. Svi smo odrasli za jedno. Mitar, Dragan, Goran, Mio. Mogu da nastavim. Svio, a? We were friends, but I am never friends. Friends that Goran and his guys killed. My fucking neighbors! Because of what? Because of shit. Lies. Fucking lies. So that makes it okay to stamp your friends in the back? Everything you believe is shown to be shit. Make strange choices. Fuck you! <laughs> strange choices? How much? <laughs> A thousand. <laughs> you kill my friends for one thousand dollars. How much do you charge to kill someone? You ruined me, you fuck! I needed the money. I had problems. You're a fucking junkie! Kill me, Dan! Living will be more painful for him than death. Let's go. Where am I? What is this place? You say I ruined you. You were always a killer. I just helped you see that. I'm lost. They will take me over to Bruce's house. I'm turning this shit off. I can't take listening to those annoying ads and DJs right now. You did the right thing. It was not often that you can be sure of it. You definitely did the right thing. Problems. Let's have a fucking party. Break out the champagne and let the diseased, traitorous junkie live after hunting him for over a decade. Shit! Someone hand me the keys to the fucking city. There's no need to take that tone, cousin. I'm sorry if my tone offends you, Roman. But this has been a very difficult moment for me. It took every fiber of my being, pulling in the same direction. Not to kill Dargo, to not get revenge for all those lives he took away. What made you spare him? I don't know. I wanted it for so long, he would just be dead. Like everyone else from our village, I was the one that survived the first attack. <laughs> Living is not easy. No. I would live to kill in Dargo as well. But then, when I looked at him, I realized that nothing would change if I killed him. The revenge would not somehow shut the book on what I have seen. Only those who die get closure. Living do not. So you keep living. And you try to have a happy life. You, you try to move on. I try to. Yes. Do you want to come in and hang with Brucey? No. I need to be alone. Thank you for being with me, cousin. Do not mention it. Call me, Nico. The wedding is soon.
Florian, I thought I should let you know. I found Darko. The guilt has destroyed him. I don't know. Somehow, it was better to walk away. You know what? I'm really proud of you, Nico Bellic. After what we've had to live with these last 12 or 13 years, I know how much it hurt you. And you walked away. I know this must be hard for you, but you won, Nico. You really did. We've got to celebrate. You're free now. Maybe a spa day? Sure, whatever. I'll speak to you soon, Bernie. There he is, Nico Bellek. Nico, these are my two brothers. Well, two of my brothers, the two that count. Derek and Gerald. Hi. Derek has just returned to the family fold after a good few years in the old country, involved in the struggle. Sort of like you, I'd imagine. And Jerry, Jerry's the man. And you remember Michael, St. Michael? <laughs> yes, yes, it's uh, nice to meet you. <laughs> Nico's a trip, man. I met him through that Puerto Rican coke dealer. So you want to involve him in family business? What do you know about him? What I know is he likes a fight and he ain't the fucking law. Oh, no offense, mister. That ain't good enough. Well, it's good enough for me. He's a good lad, Jerry. Uh, was I talking to you in bread halfwit? <coughs> I make a point of not talking to the unfortunate victims of brother sister marriage. Don't you speak about my parents like that. Oh, you're like fucking Cleopatra. Fifteen generations of brother sisters fucking, and you're so thick you take orders off my idiot brother Packy. Who's so stupid he had to tattoo his name on his arm? If there is a problem, I'll go. No trouble. I have other ways of making money. There's no problem. Jerry just likes to think he knows best about everything, which is why he's been married three times already and still won't admit he likes men. <laughs> ah, no problem. I'll leave you boys to it. Don't screw up. Packy, take care of Derek. He's been away. And you? Nothing personal, but don't fuck with my family or I will fuck with yours. All right, we're heading to the Southern Algonquin branch of the Bank of Liberty. Nico, you're the designated driver. Let's do this. going down. We're gonna go inside and each take down a security guard. Me and St. Michael here are gonna handle the civilians while Nico and Derek manage the employees. Anyone tries anything, put them down hard. Once the situation has been controlled, 
Derek's going to break the vault door with explosives. I got enough PE4 here to get through anything they throw at us. PE4? I never heard of that. It's some limey name for C4 that Derek here picked up over there. I ain't having this argument with you, Patrick. Safe to say, what we're using is controllable enough to go through any vault door without incinerating whatever's inside. Not gonna leave much residue on the notes either, so they should be washable. Oh, they're going to be washable, all right. Can't wait to see what sort of kick C4 residue is gonna give me when I snort up a line of chop through one of them notes. First, we're fucking charmer, Patrick. Second, it's PE4, not C4. Whatever, at least I'm honest about my habits, Derek. You know nothing about nothing, Patrick. I'm honest about me demons. Hit the needle on the old head there, did I, Derek? Expression is, hit the nail on the head, Packy. Really, Michael? You don't think I know that? And Jerry was right about you, Mikey. Your parents must have been twins to produce a kid as dumb as you. I'm surprised you ain't got three eyes, no balls, and a club foot. Don't bring my parents into this, Packy. All right, all right. Do we all know what we're doing? Once the vault door blows, I want Nico and Michael to go down into the vault to get the money while me and my brother handle the crowd control. All makes sense to me. If you guys didn't stop arguing for a few minutes, then I think we might be okay. This is it, boys. Moment of truth. None of you fucking fucks move! Get on the floor! None of you is gonna get a medal for playing hero. All you's gonna get is a bullet to the heart. Don't none of you worry about nothing. We're here for the bank's money. It's going to a greater cause. Shut up and handle the safe! Open the door. Open the door! Open the door! Open the fucking door! Okay, okay, wait a minute. I got it! Get on the floor! Now! But sir! You too! Okay, okay! Hey, yo! I'm a gun club member. I'm gonna take these rookies downtown. Are you with me? What's your name, son? Luis. But this ain't such a good idea, bro. Yeah? They said catching that pass in my high school championship football game was a bad idea, because I broke my leg in 13 places, but I scored a touchdown and won the game. The world was built out of bad ideas, my friend. Come on. The PE-4 has been molded and is set to explode in 60 seconds. Now listen, people, we're your friends. Me and me brother here. Why are you telling them we're brothers, you idiot? That's gonna make it hard for them to find us, isn't it? I'm trying to be honest with these people. We put them through a lot today. Fuck these people, fuck your cause. That shit's over. Ireland's not the only thing that's green. Dollars are too. Now you've said bloody Ireland. That's gonna narrow the search, ain't it? Fuck you! Take the needle out your arm, then tell me what to do! I'll let you tell me what to do when you stop shoving half a Bolivia up your nose every Saturday night! Motherfucker! Ooh. Fuck! Oh. We told you not to fuck with us! Oh. Shit! Michael! Saint fucking Michael! <laughs> fucking shit! Get the money! Me and my brother will watch the kids! Keep your heads down! I got all the money I could. There's still some in there, though. We ain't got time to go back in. Let's move out, boys!
Move in, move in. Go, 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 go. They're after us, boys. Check the other platform.
Michael was unlucky. It wasn't anybody's fault what happened to him. And the explosive did its job. The both of you, shut the fuck up! There's gotta be a way out of here, boys. Come on! Up, up, up! Come on, let's go! Cops on us, people! Shit, 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 shit! Michael! Damn it! I could have been nice to him for once in my fucking life! Kid only wanted to help! I loved you, Packy. He was happy he spoke to him. Didn't matter what you were saying. Yeah, well, now I gotta explain to his folks that his son is lying dead on the floor of a bank and I'm gone. Give them this cut. When your kid is living a life, you gotta expect someone to come through the door and break this sort of news. That does not make it any easier to hear. And we aren't safe yet. Eye on the road, Nico! We don't want you to have to break no bad news to our mom. Neither do I. Nico, you're a damn good man. I wasn't just driving you two. The money was in the car as well. Remember that. We won't forget it, Nico. Here's your cut. I tell Jerry you did good. He might give you a call or something. 